distinction test between haloalkane and haloarene so the test which is used to distinguish the two is silver nitrate test silver nitrate is agno3 in the presence of hno3 now haloalkane or we can say any halogen compound which contain cx bond ch3 x so this is the part of haloalkane then there is one more example benzyl halide that is ch2x and next one is the allyl halide in all the three cases the halogen is attached to carbon which is sp3 hybridized halogen is attached to carbon which is sp3 hybridized in all the three cases now in these three cases if we separately treat them with agno3 then they will form the precipitate of agx ch3x will form agx plus ch3no3 in case of benzyl halide it will form agx and whole compound with no3 here also agx so any compound in which carbon attached halogen is sp3 hybridized will give positive agno3 test now in case of haloarene or the compound in which halogen is attached to a carbon which is sp2 hybridized now these two carbon now are sp2 hybridized so now if we treat them with agno3 then they will not give the positive test or we can say they will not form any precipitate so this test easily distinguish between the two if we are given an example of methyl chloride and chlorobenzene then methyl chloride will give agno3 test but haloarene will not give agno3 test similarly if we are given benzyl chloride and chlorobenzene then benzyl chloride will give this test but chlorobenzene will not give any precipitate 